let's try to go for another session here. We're gonna go for yes. Moving on to the other next episode of what it's like inside a, a butthole. Ah, oh, welcome, privates. You are now inside a, 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 a hospital patient's rectum. You know why I'm in here already? Well, I'm not going to go there. Oh, God. No, I'm not going to go there. Anyway, moving on. Your job is to go up the duodenum and determine what this individual had for lunch. Coming I'm along. sending oh. Rock Solid to be your good guy. It's going out, dude. Expert explorer. And Natty, in the bro. Wilderness of Inland, that's Natty. That's just what you'll need. He's got your time card. Pretty sure this guy is the mountain. Chapter. Good luck scouting time, Scout. I wonder why certain audio things are not working and other things are. It's just only those few instances during like the in-between cutscenes that it doesn't work. But this I think I can live with it. This must be where the Vikings landed in <laughs> North America in 1002. Hmm. But the Vikings should have sailed home by now. Hmm. We better find out what went wrong. Ahoy! It's like McGee and me. My ship! A my scoundrels ship. run off with my poor ship! How it dare they? almost reached the horizon! The horizon, you say? No! This is totally McGee and me, the, you know, freaking Nordic version of McGee and me. Three hairs? By Thor's hammer, my ship has been pilfered! Oh. I must summon my crew for a thing! I'm stuck my Batmobile! Oh! Well, who the hell are you? Erickson's the name. I'm an explorer like my father, Eric the Red. <laughs> I've led my loyal crew here to the Vinland. Leif Erickson was also known as Leif <laughs> the Lucky, but Luckless might be a better name for him today. Oh, I was thinking of Leif Garrett. Not <laughs> Garrett Leif. <laughs> it is landsman, it is. Another Greenlander, Bjarni Haraldson, passed Bjergen, the shores, Bjergen, but the never landed. Bjergen. That sorry, was an I had honor. To I'm me. sorry. Cringe, and now cringe. I must return to Greenland. It's not so very green. It's very creamy. Why to spread tidings of my discovery to the Norse people? The nipple people. And after eight after long, eight long here, legs, even a the spider is now existing here. What happened to your ship? A it looks like it's made for a woman. Took our ship. You don't Without speak that way to me. Marooned in Vinland forever. Why do you speak like an ancient uh, Irishman? Alas, no. But I did catch a whiff oh, of God. something vile in the air. It smells like Carmen San Diego's vile hench henchman's vile farts. I'll keep an eye on the ship while you summon my crew for a thing. Or perhaps what you're smelling is like the, the shockwave effect of me putting the latrine water in that guy's bath water from eons ago. I mean, hey. A thing is, is an assembly of theory. Norsemen gathered to make an important group decision. This democratic practice was brought from a Iceland thing. to Greenland by my father, Eric the Red. <laughs> Tell us more about your With thing. With a fleet of 25 <laughs> ships, my father, Eric the Red, sailed from Iceland to settle Greece. You know why they called him Eric the Red? Despite having a blonde in our family lineage, his crotch hair was red only. Of course, everyone he had to wear a merkin, their their blonde color. Before a decision is reached, there'd always be doubt if we left someone out. If you ask me one more question, I shall take my fist and take it all the way up your rectum. Okay, thank you. No more questions. What's up? Um, will we help the thing to Let's talk leave? to all of his Viking crewmen and get them to come to the shore. All right. Well, can we walk to the boat? Vikings were expert sailors. Yeah, we all know that. Same with the Polynesians. Viking. Yeah, ocean. The Atlantic Ocean is wide and treacherous. Only the sturdiest sailors and jealous of this guy's it. dulcet tones coming from his microphone. We Norsemen may be skilled sailors, but we prefer to stay within sight of land. While crossing the wide ocean, we Yet spent you guys several anxious cross days the with nothing in sight but water. But water, and it gave us many an anxiety. Too bad I ran out of my Percocets. Walk to settlement. Talk to rock solid. I want to go to that tree. All right. Hurry back. If this follows the same sort of uh, theme as the other ones. It's going to be two two or three frames and then you're done with the level. <laughs> I could have made a game like this. In fact, I might. I started to, actually. Based on my cottage up north. But it got too ambitious. It got, you know, too many bosses that I wanted to do. Remember, just Enemies talk to me if you kid. need any help, partner. If we just walk to the settlement and, like, that's it? Oh, there's a piece of paper. Good oh, there's eye. our little guy in the it's distance. We are a little guy. Note to her thief. Yes. To my dear bosom. From stern to blowing your dick, 
Your thieving thing must not be a stick. Okay. Was there any point to that overlay? Just to find that note and that's it? Probably something I could have, like, clicked on, but I don't know. I'm not here to, like, you know, sniff the roses, so to speak. I did before, when I was younger. Like, I used to, like, just click everything. But for the sheer sake of entertainment value, we're not going to keep it up here. I'm just going to kind of... I'm not speedrunning it, but I'm not, you know, like I said, pongs. Dimphus. Welcome. What's but going on? back, this sword is white hot. Would you like to be Ming Ming, Mr. Captain Hawk? A sword was a Viking's most precious weapon. Besides from the weapon between his All legs. All I need is ming, a spot ming, of ming, ming. to finish off this ceremonial blade. Well, Mr. Hawk, would Hello you please put the Ming Ming in my this Bung Bung? This ceremonial blade will be the best I've ever made. I take this cold, hard steel and I stroke it over and weapon. over and over again. All I Bottle shield. The Viking shield was brightly painted and usually made, made of wood. wood with <laughs> iron in the center and around it. Why don't they talk about the that berserkers? Shield can be held by you know, those guys are ballers. Taking like, you know, That's a battle psychedelic drugs the and getting well psyched up in battle. Smashing and cutting power. All right, we got something in the foreground the here. Feel free to borrow it. Oh, cool. I'm going to take it, bitch. Yeah. Thor's hammer. <laughs> That's an ornamental Why necklace do they have... called Thor's hammer. <laughs> Thor was one of the Viking gods like Woden, Loki, and Frey. Some of the days of the week in our modern calendar are named after Norse gods. Yes, yes. Okay. Tongs. I need that for Black carrying Nets around other things that I'm not allowed to like touch anymore. To hold on to Such as little boys. Metal. I get blisters just thinking about it. Ta. All right. I don't need to talk to you anymore, Forge. Okay. Blacksmithing was very important to the Viking. Yeah. Chains. Spear. Vikings yeah. used long, sharp spears as thrusting weapons. Talk about um, a tough axe is going to be used for something, and I'm trying to remember what now. Um, can I take the shield? No, I can't. Can I take Thor's hammer? No, I can't. Can I take the tongs? No, I can't. Can I take the man? Okay, I might as well talk to Igor. I know it says Igor, I'm just saying Igor because it's funny. I've ever made. Hello again. This ceremonial blade will be the best I've ever made. Uh oh, is it freaking out? Okay, I thought it was. I'm Ivor the Blacksmith. I make huge <laughs> and armor for I'll the see Norse him years community. later constructing um, weapons in Dark Souls. Iron mostly. For a blacksmith, iron is as good as. Good is good. Winter is my brother. I'm using a blade of iron in my forge. Then hammering oh, you know how to braid! Then you can do my daughter's it hair for me in the morning when she's screaming and blocking and doesn't want to go to daycare. But I need a little silver to finish it off. Eh, just to make it look a little pretty. Right, the sword is a Norseman's most valued weapon. We even give our swords dramatic names <laughs> like... Atrophy or Dragon Bar. But I can't name this new sword until I have some silver. Oh, oh, literally, what is stopping you from naming it before you I'm have another elemental I metal? I until I polished off this sword with some fine silver. A well crafted. Okay, we get it. We need some silver. Get the f out of here. Is there any other options here? Okay. Walking out. Farewell, travelers. Get Come stepping. Come back and visit my forge again. Get the fuck out of my face until you bring me some silver. Walk the hillside. Hell yeah, bitch. I really need to get on making my own point-and-click adventure. This era was just so underrated. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say that exactly, but... Can I chop him up with the axe? Uh, well, let's first ask... That's the battle axe we borrowed yeah, from Ivor. Let's use the axe on grapes. Can That's I? That's a battle axe <laughs> and a tomahawk. Not much good for throwing. See, I love that they actually programmed that in. I mean, that's a ton of if conditional statements, you know, but I... Leif may have named someone this was gonna country do it. Finland because of all the grapes growing here. All right. Yeah. Good thinking. You may be ripped, but, but you can't grow tall. Manlet. Fuck off. All right. I can chop down a tree. What are we gonna walk to hilltop? Walk to riverbank. We got quite a bit of options here. I can ask him yes. some questions. How can we help? I believe play? he needed something. Silver. That's right. Let's go to hilltop. Everyone knows that silver migrates to the top of hills. <laughs> quite a bit of different um, things here. You know, here's something weird. I, I didn't give this virtual sh machine much power, but it still should be able to go into the next scene without issue. Oh, who kissed me, Blarney Stone? They're always after me, Lucky Charms. 
<laughs> I want the helmet. Helmet. You know, real Viking helmets didn't actually have horns. That's just a myth. Or so they say. Horns? On a helmet? Who starts these crazy rumors anyway? I don't know. Probably someone who was horny. Why, hello. Don't act like you didn't say anything stupid Watch when you were horny. these tools, because I'm a chiseling fool. If I don't flatten this stone, I can't carve my runes. Oh, get a little past, get and try as you might. Uh, oh wait. Oh, God. Who are you? Even though we already know I'm since Olaf the little the finger Rune points maker. it out. I record the exploits of my fellow Norsemen and... And our gods? In other words, you're a storyteller. I'm trying and to flatten here, this rock. <laughs> so I can carve some Norse runes. <laughs> All letters in the Norse alphabet are made up of straight lines so that they are easy to carve into stone. Yeah, if you're retarded. Here, let's see. Sorry, not until I flattened this He's rock come to the shore for finished thing. my runes. I keep on forgetting that he is, it is a proper noun. It's an actual thing. Okay. That tough old stump has quite a weight on its shoulders. All right, so we're going to kill him. That's the battle axe we borrowed from Ivan. Yes, Ivan the Terrible. Put your shoulder behind it and give that stump a solid thump. Can someone please tell me what I'm actually doing this for, though? Like, I get that I could do it, but I still don't know why I did it. Woohoo! <laughs> this boulder's broken flat. At last, I can carve out my room. But why did I need grapes? Like, <laughs> I know that I can get them. I don't know that why I need old them. stump has quite a weight on its shoulders. Okay, uh... Bef what does this say? Okay. Runes often described details of Norse mythology. These, but are, these are more runes personal are more and sexual. Personal. They say, say I, I, Olaf, Olaf the Rune Maker, defeated, defeated a another Viking woman in, in the Battle of Sexes. Sure he did. I'm also six foot two and never make any mistakes. Oops. Rune. Oops. Right. Okay, so he can stand up and get them. But still, why do I need? Wait, okay, he threw him at me. Rock is just what we needed. What, a we got the grapes. what are you in high school? Egging people's houses? Is that you throw grapes at people? What's next? Midget tossing? Sorry, we just lost Olaf. Ran off like a turd. I love the Irish folk music in the more in the Norse uh, history lesson. Sorry if you guys aren't learning anything. I'll do a more detailed walkthrough if you guys want to, but honestly, I'm just playing through to be funny. Ooh! <laughs> How oh, deliciously wet! This guy looks like Olaf and the guy from the first part. Hello there. Who who are you and why? I'm Turker, the southerner. Why are I you? I grew up in a country south of the Norse homeland. Uh, we just I saw it. Oh, it looks like sparkling silver. I couldn't help myself. The delicious grapes around here do not grow in chilly Greenland. <laughs> well, too bad they do. I would Oops. eat. Come to the shore for the thing. Sorry, that water is cold. It's over my head. Because you just tried to get grapes and you fell in the water. And I obviously see silver here, so I'm gonna ignore this guy. Do I even need to get the grapes if I need the silver? Look at it, I helped him out. Okay. Do I have to entice him with grapes? Use grapes on grass. Ooh, there's another piece of paper. A shard of Carmen's card. <laughs> Our thief can't be too far. God. My idea, Baron. From stern to blowing dick, your thieving must not have a stick. Give leave the merry slip aboard this merry ship. Try keeping right on course by hiding near someone doing intercourse. All right. So can I Hello tell this guy to again. move? Now, I don't know why I need to. Can I give him grapes? I don't Yum, know why did grapes. I need to give him them. I have My the silver. Favorite. What an appetite. I bet oh, he has to go to the thing. For some more fresh grapes. Even though he has a perfect chance to just leave right now. Wait. Yum! Grapes! My favorite. I gave you grapes! Go what to the an thing! Appetite. I bet he'd jump at a chance for some more fresh grapes. I gi I'm giving him more grapes! Yum! Grapes! <laughs> My favorite! What an app. Okay. Thank you, but I'd rather eat than fight. And you won't take my f***ing grapes. You murder you guy. Um. Those stones are really st those stone. Oh wait, 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 wait. Ooh. <laughs> this is this is logical journey of the Zumbini's level of like bad. He's like, I needed to be led by like a horse to water. 
but can't force him to eat grapes. All right, I don't need to talk to you. Walk to settlement. That was a nice shortcut. All right, um, we need to talk to the guy in the sod house who's making phallic objects. Give him some silver. A nugget of pure silver. Thank oh, you. No, he kissed me blurry stone. Ding, ding, ding. Why is it like go? He's not making a pizza. Oh god, so they made it look like smithing was that simple. That's the last piece of Carmen's note. Let's decode her tattered text. Of the modern word for starboard. Carmen. Now that the notes right? are together, it's time right. to fire up the time cuffs for an arrest. Wait, where is say I should go? Mary slip above it. Okay, we gotta go on the ship. Even though we got grapes and an axe, what else could we possibly need? So, starboard is right. I think it's port starboard. Port is right, I think, because it has RT in it. I think that's what my old rule used to be. Alright. Uh, go to the thing. What is this magic? You have a book that describes everything that's going to happen before it happens. So let's make some magic happen. Welcome to the thing. <laughs> we have a decision to make. Shall we recover the stolen ship and return home, or instead accept where Thor's These guys hammer are like has brothers. fallen and settle here in Vinland? Personally, I would like to return to Greenland with news of our discovery. I've had enough fighting and raiding. Vinland is they forgot present the enough. raping and pillaging. We Norsemen should strike fear into the hearts of our enemies. Let's reclaim our ship. Now that the choices are clear, let's vote and decide what to do. Let's make a vote for our thing. All who prefer to remain in Vinland, show your All who cowardly prefer to mitts. remain a virgin, no show your cowardly titties. Now, all those noble souls who would prefer to reclaim our ship and return in glory to Greenland, please raise your loyal your hands. Your royal hands. Um, well, it doesn't take the wisdom of Warden to see that a tie won't help us decide. Let us reconsider the issues at hand. Is there someone else that I'm missing? What? Like what? As I said, I vote we recover our Norse ship and sail home to Greenland. What are your votes? Uh... We should settle this new land for future generations up. We've been away from our family. Let's stay. Remember, there aren't any gr Hmm. Do you think we okay, should we say something? Okay, we just have to bother him, okay. Uh, let's keep out of the vote. But where? What else are we gonna? Okay, let's try to break the king's tide vote. What are you doing, landsman? Only worthy Norsemen can vote in a thing. I know that you get to vote but in Leif, it. But Leif, we are worthy Norsemen uh, in spirit. Spirit. What mm, is a spirit? That's quite a claim. You must prove it. <laughs> Talk about All your Norse Norse know mythology. That we have named trivia. our days after the gods of Valhalla. Frey uh, is the Norse god of sunshine uh, and rain. What day House of comes Frey. before Frey's day? Uh, Tyr's day, Thor's day, Woden's day. May we hear the question again? I'm We rocking. say Thor's day. That's right. But you might have been lucky, like me. <laughs> That's I'm how I got through school. One more question. Oh, oh, the Norse god of thunder wields a mighty hammer. What day comes after Thor's day? Freeze day. It's French fries we day. We say phrase day. Right again. You must be How Norse would you know what the days of the week are? We'd it's like you've been you through every day of the week. Thing. Now that the choices are clear, let's vote and decide what to Two do. Two questions and I'm already All an honorary Norseman. to remain in Vinland, show your cowardly mitts. It's pretty much no like being an SJW. This thing is rigged. Now, all those noble souls who would prefer to reclaim our ship and return in glory to Greenland, please raise your loyal hands. No. No. Well done. The issue is decided. Prepare the landing boat for battle. We've decided to make a boat ride out to the boat. And we make an arrest on the right hand side. I want to say my first guess was Starboard is on the right. I guess I'll learn myself. I never passed a boater safety, so don't give me shit. It's like, but Ben, you do own a boat, and you're an operator of a boat. Yeah, f you. I don't care. I'm not a fucking chartered captain. Sue me. I wonder if this book has a recipe for those black holes he used to use in those uh, old Acme cartoons. Great job. With our help, the Vikings have reclaimed their stolen ship. That simple, the huh? The Vikings are ready to set sail. 
but we still need to catch a stowaway. Let's Take a look at Carmen's room. note and remember the time cuffs. All right. Well, I can just keep on. Uh, I can just keep guessing until I when get it right. When sailing or rowing, the Vikings slide these sturdy sea chests to the sides of the ship and use them as benches. Okay. Rope. Vikings used tarred rope to seal the seams between a ship's wooden planks. A little tacky, maybe, but effective. How would that freaking work? I mean, rope was already freaking hard to get a hold of, I'm sure. Shield! This old shield has certainly... Okay. Sail. The Vikings used a single square sail to harness the wind. That's it? Knorr ships like this one generally used about 20 oars, but big long ships built for war had as many as Good 80. Lord. Talk about having a lot of pull. Imagine having to, like, freaking row that long. Um, since I can't go anywhere, I'm guessing it's the sh chest on the left. Nope. It no was the right. There. Okay. Port right. Or starboard on the right. Alright. Nope. No thief there. It's... Nope. No thief there. Okay. Did I miss something? It's something in the modern work for starboard, right? Try keeping right on course near the source. I mean, where else could I use it? On the sail? Nope. No thief there. I'm just going to keep a rest. ships like this one. Use grapes on Thor. I'd love some, but I'm watching my weight. Oh, yes. You can tell by your percolating pecs. Nope. No thief just there. Just keep on... Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Steer board. What? Of course! Our thieving rascal is hiding behind the steerboard to starboard. I didn't know that was an independent object there. I thought it was part of the background. Just like the shield. But that was an independent object. Never mind. Sure. Yeah, would you imagine getting arrested by that guy? He'd make you regret it real fast. He's like a bouncer at a highly exclusive club. Come on, Baron. We've got a nice bear cell Baron ready for Wolfhausen. you at Acme headquarters. You may have caught me, but you'll never wipe away the Baron's gleaming grit. Who the Baron of? 1970s transatlantic accents? 70s. I'm at 30s. Well, children, are you ready to give up yet? Yeah, pretty much. I'm actually going to take a break and just edit this down in a sec. Oh, I love grapes. Thank you. You restored Viking history, and thanks to you, Leif Erikson will make it back to Europe to spread Leif the Garrett word about the new still continue world. to make music and not be Nordic. Carmen well, still times oh, go. God. You're She's quite sexy. Home. You apprehended the Baron, but there's no way you'll foil my next foray. It's already underway. Ta-ta. Oh, well... Good job, agents. Carmen just sent us a nasty gram. What are you going to do about it? Ah, uh, we're going to call it quits for now. Anyway, it's been good. Thanks for hanging out, guys. Um, I'm glad I could still uh, do some updates here while I got some free time. It's my birthday. Anyway. Take care. Oops, I probably shouldn't have quit that. Oh, well. We'll find out.